Root Miners in the mix. mix. Alright guys, we're back with another video and this one we're gonna do a mid fade with um curls on top. We're only gonna cut like half an inch up the top. So yeah. Right here, it's important to comb down the hair, so just make sure that all the hairs are in place and use any brush. I'm using just a regular comb, and I'm starting off with the two guard just to get rid of like some of the bulk, and just make sure you go all around the head. To start off with the haircut, just make a bald guideline. I'm using my Slimline Pro Ally. As you can see right there, um, I left off the front line a, a little, little darker, just so I can make the hook. Right here, I'm just balding out the bottom. I'm just using my wall magic clips. I made them into a balding clipper. And I'm just going up, all the way up to the line. Now with any shavers, just shave off the bottom. I'm using my Andy shavers and I'm, I'm not going all the way up because it's making like a hard guideline. And if I go all the way up, it's gonna be hard to take off. So just go up like almost all the way. Since I left a, a little faint guideline, I'm just going back with my TL liners and trying to remove that line. Sometimes it doesn't completely take it off. So you're gonna have to go back with the shavers and like, just lightly press on it. Now to make the first actual guideline, I'm using my um, wall magic clips, not the balding ones, but a different one. And I'm going up like, like a half an inch. I'm going with the no guard. Just make sure you keep it the same length all the way around the head. In the back, I'm going a little, a little higher just because you have more space to work in the back but in the side I'm going up like half an inch. I close the lever all the way and I'm going up like a third of the way just I'm doing a section at a time I'm fitting out a section at a time so as you saw there I'm, I went up a third of the way and then I close the lever halfway and try to flick out that middle line. I just use the lever I just play around with the lever to get to fade it out completely. With the second guideline, I'm using the one close and I'm just going up another half an inch. To get rid of the guideline in between the one close and the no guard I'm using my zero open and I'm just using the corner to flick out that line I don't want to go all the way up just make sure you're flicking out because you or else you're gonna make another guideline and you don't want that just use the corner of the blade with the final guideline I'm using the number two guard open and I'm just going I'm just going up like the rest of the way now to get rid of that guideline in between the one close and the two open i'm using the one open i'm just flicking it out 
sometimes it gets rid of the, that guideline, but in this case it didn't. So I'm gonna have to come back with the one and a half guard halfway close and get rid of the guideline. Now my client wanted me to cut off a half an inch up the top and when it comes to the top just make sure you stay consistent don't cut off too much in some area just keep it all the same now to blend from the number two guard to the long hairs he has on top i'm using clipper over comb and trying to go in too much just just try to get rid of that bulk. Right here I'm just clipping off his hairs in the front just to make the lining up process a little easier. And I'm just combing down the hairs. With the with the lineup, you just gotta keep it straight. Try not to push him back. Make sure you comb down the hairs because sometimes and the first go you don't really get all of them and the clipper moves the hairs and you just have to comb it back in place i don't know if that makes sense but like you just have to make sure you keep combing and try to make everything level With the C cup, just try to make it sharp and make it the same as on both sides. It doesn't have to be perfect the first time because you can come back with the knife and make it a little sharper. But just make sure it's, it's the same on both sides. Applying some shaving just just to make the the knife glide a little easier. With the straight razor, you just gotta pull, pull back the skin and just put the straight razor at an angle, and you'll be good. You won't you won't cut them. Especially since you put the shaving gel, and it'll make the straight razor glide a little easier. Right here I'm applying some enhancement just to make the lineup pop out a little more and a little more sharper. Alright guys, so that was the cut. And if you liked it, please like. If you have any any specific haircuts you guys want to see, just comment down below. Please subscribe and PC everyone.